Now back to the coronavirus. California lawmakers are coming up with ways to boost state revenue during the pandemic. One of the proposals rolled out today, a tax on California's richest of the rich. 17's Ashley Zavala explains. California Democrats unveiled a proposal Thursday to add another tax to the wealthiest in the state. There is an absolute limit to how much wealth one uh, individual can accumulate while people are literally struggling to survive. The bill, AB 2088, would put an annual tax rate of 0.4% on residents with a worldwide net worth of $30 million or more. Those subject to the wealth tax would need to report all assets, including stocks, bonds, cash, private equity or hedge funds, and other financial assets to the state's franchise tax board, which would then manage tax collection. Lawmakers say this would be a first in the nation law, generating $7.5 billion a year. They say the tax would be imposed upon the top 0.15% of earners in California, or about 30,000 people. The ultra super wealthy who can quarantine on a yacht. But critics say this could push already valuable taxpayers to leave the state. John Kapal is the president of the Howard Jarvis Taxpayers Association. We already have the highest income tax rate in America at 13.3%. And to add this notion of a wealth tax, I think is extremely foolish and, and quite frankly, I doubt it will gain traction even as progressive as this legislature is. Lawmakers admit the proposal won't get a hearing or go through the legislative process before the end of session August 31st. Advocates are hoping for an informational hearing during recess with the possibility of reintroducing it in January. In Sacramento, Ashley Zavala, 17 News.